I've been going to gym for the last maybe say four to five years. Uh, it all started out from me quitting smoking. So that was how I wanted to find something else to focus on. I don't have really good qualifications in terms of my study. Uh, I took my O-level twice. I left Polytechnic after six months. But because of that, uh, I was experiencing a lot of uncertainty and then that was when I went into certain full-time jobs. But I realised that actually real estate could also be an avenue for me to do better for myself and my family. And that was when I also met a friend and he, you know, he explained to me, um, he told me more about real estate as in there is no limit for your income, um, there are no qualifications, it's all about how hard you want to work, how much hunger you have uh, and the drive to succeed. Uh, that was when I felt that you know, being young, I had nothing to lose. I just pretty much left my full-time job, I gave up my bonuses, I just went all in uh, to real estate and that was actually how I started uh, in this industry. Now, during my rebellious stage, uh, it's funny that my parents were never angry or frustrated. Uh, in fact, they... <laughs> well, so my parents back then, they were never angry with me. Uh, they were always supporting me. So I think they didn't say much. But yeah, they even came to look for me. But it, it is what it is, you know. So at the point of time, uh, it was really at the wrong period of my life but I guess they never gave, gave up on me so during the pandemic it was actually very difficult for us during the first month because that was the first month of circuit breaker but after the first month we were actually quite shocked that it actually extended so that was when we started reconnecting with all our clients we texted them individually one by one uh, we set up many Zoom appointments and we in fact we created our whole new website uh, all within a span of two weeks as well. So it was possibly the hardest two weeks I've ever worked in all my years of real estate. There was one incident in 2021 which was last year uh, that was actually very memorable, not in a good way. Uh, we were actually very uh, close into closing a very huge deal back then. Um, that deal was probably about uh, 250000 just for one transaction in terms of commission. Uh, we, we, we were almost so close into transacting it, um, but the buyers just had some last minute uncertainty and eventually they backed out of the deal. Nothing comes straight away. Uh, it's not like you can do this and then you can become this immediately the next day. Uh, both are equally difficult, both takes time to nurture, both takes time, both takes discipline, both takes consistency. So I think this really helps my mindset to change along the way. I will, I'm certain that in the past, I used to not have this discipline and consistency, but I think along the way, this has actually changed me quite a fair bit as well uh, in, in my real estate, in my career. I have always believed in discipline and consistency. So these two things has been always firmly etched into my mind um, because these are the daily things that bring us a long way. And of course, the last thing would be to have faith in whatever that we do because by having faith, that would keep me positive regardless of any situations. I hope so. I hope my parents are proud of me. I definitely would hope so. I think that's one uh, very strong motivation that will keep me going.